Hey everybody, Eric Blankenship here. The news crews don't do that. Well, pick up their paper. Pick up the notes. Well, the some house. of them do here of late, and they actually tap them like this when they're done. They do. But anyway, we're here for the people of All Access Coach. I'm the anchor, Eric, and this is the co-anchor, like maybe well, maybe like a weather girl. Like a this is Brian, Brian Hudson. Like traffic, maybe. Yeah, maybe traffic is yeah. it. Yeah. Uh, yeah, traffic. So anyway, welcome to it. This is the people of All Access Coach. We usually don't start out this way. It's a lot more professional, but I had to get my notes together. Our uh, person this week we're talking about is one of our clients, and his name is Brian Regan. I don't know if you know who Brian Regan is or not. We're going to put a picture up right here. That's Brian. Brian is a stand-up comedian, and I'll have to say one of the funniest individuals I have ever ever seen live mm -hmm. uh seen a lot of comedians he is absolutely got the best facial expressions of any comedian i've ever seen i've re i was reading an article on him one time he does all of his uh, material on real life situations from going to the dentist going to the this tax accountant i mean just it, it i, I can see that like that he that's what forms his little bits the one cool thing about him he his show is 100 percent clean so if you go with your mom or you go with your seven-year-old daughter or you go with it's not an uncomfortable feeling like, oh, gosh, I, I, you know, his, his jokes are good, clean, uh, fun. And I'm telling you, his show changes. I saw him um, one time and about, went and saw him about two months later, and it was a completely different show. That's impressive. Yeah. So you know, a lot of times those guys will get into a rut and right. they just do the, the same thing. But he, he's not that way. He's of Irish descent. His brother, uh, Dennis, is actually uh, makes his living as a stand-up comedian also. And he has seven brothers and sisters. Large family. Yeah. So he's been on David Letterman, you said, 28 different episodes? Mm -hmm. Wow. I did not realize that. But Brian is, uh, is so, so, so funny. Uh, we built him a bus here several years ago. I flew out to Las Vegas and uh, met with him out there to to talk over the bus and and uh he's very dry uh so and, and almost kind of shy right you know but uh so talking with him i was jokes with i am i'm i'm cracking jokes or making fun of stuff and he's not knowing if i'm being serious right. or if i'm not and uh anyway i i don't know if i should tell it but i'm gonna tell it he he said something about he wanted a bathroom up front that you know that you can you know do uh you know and i i i i'm, I'm not i'm not following you what do you mean right. you know where where you can uh you know some 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 toilets on buses you can't do it on but i want one up front that you can be able to he just would never say it right you know? he said you know and i just kept going like i don't know man i don't i don't know and he goes well, you know, where, where, where you can do number two. And I said, really? I said, I've never run into that before. And he goes, well, really, why not? I said, because most of you artists think your stuff don't stink anyway, so I don't know why you'd be worried about it. And he, he started laughing. He said, well, I'm not worried about me. I'm worried about Aunt Edna when she comes on board. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> so anyway, it was a funny, it was a funny, it kind of broke the ice with, with, with us, and, and he kind of realized uh, where my, my where my sense of humor was, but Brian is a great guy. We love having him as a client uh, here at All Access, and and uh, he's just he's just a fun guy. If you ever get a chance to go see him, I'm telling you, spend the money, take your wife, take your kids, take your grandma, whoever, and go see the man. You will be hooked. He's <laughs> absolutely hilarious. So, I want to say thank you, Brian, for being one of the people of All Access Coach and helping us get where we are today. And we hope that we have many many years to come here so brian thanks for being here today digging that hat why don't you just continue to wear that it looks really good <laughs> matter of fact i had a listener say or a watcher viewer say you know brian looks way better in the hat than he does without that so just give you that tidbit so there you go george i told him live on 386 that's it we'll see you next time